kind of why I like Kano. Well, speaking of Kano, Kano versus Azalea. That's what we're going to be doing today. And uh, who wants to go first? Roll off, D6. Uh, yes. Let me snag some tokens real quick from my token bag. And uh, we are recording this now, so uh, it's going to be on Go Again Gaming. I'm joined again by uh, the same gentleman who you would have saw, well, not saw, but uh, saw the play of last time, and that was uh, you were playing Arachne last time. Um, yeah, and, uh, yeah, this time um, I'm doing Kano. I'm trying to do a little off, a few off meta picks, but now that he's picked up a game, I'm worried. It's like, oh, maybe he's a meta pick. Yeah. I don't know. I love the man. I love Kano, so. Well. Good luck, have fun. Oh, you as well, brother. And uh, I'm going to roll 2d6. I got 10. Uh, that is a 6. It's not me. I guess I I think I want to go first. Alright, bet. I think. Yeah. We'll see what happens. Alright then. So, tuning to 1. Rocking 2ab. Um, and we're going to start with a pitcher yellow into death dealer. Okay. To load in this red Bolton shot and draw a card. And then we'll play this lace with inertia. And then fire this for seven with go again if it hits inertia token. What's the token? Inertia? Yes, yeah, so you can't ask no anything. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. um, I'm gonna go ahead and activate Kano. Yes. Spin the top. Spin the top. Mm -hmm. We'll go ahead and leave that there. Okay. A block for six. Uh, take one down to twenty nine. Cool, and then uh, that is a hit, so I can choose to reload a card, which yep. I will do. I'll reload this. Okay. Activate the cross wrap, flip up this, have a look. Uh, activate Azalea, which breaks this. Put this ravenous rabble into my arsenal. Okay. I'll then fire that off at you as well, uh, revealing a red in the ledger on top. So it's four with go again. Okay. All right, four go again. I think I'm just gonna take me some four damage. Go to 25. All right. Oops. And that is it. I will arsenal this last card. And right. pass. Drawing a red in the ledger. And I'll draw my three. Hmm. Interesting. Interesting. Aether Wildfire for four. Oh, no. And... Yeah, I'm just going to say... Actually, hold on, hold on. Bit of a misplay. I'm going to go ahead and Crucible first. With an Aether, another Aether Wildfire. So it's Aether Wildfire for five. Okay. Could be a large error, but I'm going to say no arcane barrier on that. All right, that'll work. Take five. All right. Yep. All right. I'm going to go to end my turn. I'm going to arsenal, but it's just going to get swept away. That's right. So that, that works for me. Okay, well, you just burn me for five. Yep. 
Twenty-five right. to thirty-five. Okay, then. Tunic to two. Cross wrap. It's worth it. Flip up this codex. Have a look at the top card. Okay. Activate Azalea, put this Remorseless into my arsenal with Dominate. Yeah, that's fine. And then we will uh, read the Glide Path, look at the top card. Okay. And then we will fire this Remorseless at you for 8 with Dominate. I'll pitch for 1. I'm going to go into... Put an absorb in aether. Uh, it'll block two of it, but the next source I deal that deals arcane damage deals two more. Right. Okay. Yep. Uh, all right. Go to it. Uh, let's see. I'm going to activate Kano. Okay. Uh, it's an energy potion. Nice. Well, that that was a bit of a bust. <laughs> Oh, well, can't want them all. I'll take six, go to 19. 19. Yep. Uh, I'm just thinking whether I want to snappies that. I think I do. Yeah, I will do. So after you declare that, I'll do this. Snapdragons. Okay, go again. Um, then I'll pitch into Death Dealer. Okay. Put this another. I'm going to respond to that. Yep. I'm going to crack the E pot in the pitch of Sonic Boom, activate Kano. Kano. Okay. You got it. Cool. So I draw a card from that, and then I'll just fire this other Remorseless at you for five. Got to take it. Go to 14. I'm with it every step of the way. Epic. And now you've got two remorseless triggers on the stack as well. So whenever you play an action, you lose a life. Well, you lose two life. Yep. yep. And that's it. I'll pass. I'm done. I'm going <laughs> to my end. I'm going to clean up. Okay. Yeah. So. Kind of can't control it, man. Sometimes he's with you. Sometimes... No. Alright then, so use Tunic. Death Dealer in this Red and the Ledger. Draw a card. Yeah. Uh, Dang, I've been forgetting Tunic. Oh well. Wouldn't have been relevant. <laughs> oh well, these things happen. Uh, so I'm going to lace it with Blood Rot and Release Attention. Then I'm going to fire this Red and the Ledger at you. Pitching this. Uh, so it's coming in for 11. If it hits, Blood Rot Pox. I'm a block for eight. Take three. Cool. And I have a blood rot. You do indeed. Got eight. Dang, this is going fast. This is going fast. Indeed. Yeah. Well, sure go. I'm just going to play uh, energy potion and pass it. Okay. Cross wrap, flip up this rain razors, look at the top card. That can go to the bottom. Wow. Play the rain razors. Alright, plus two. Plus two. Then we will pitch to Death Dealer, load in a sleep dart, draw a card. And then we will. Uh, Premeditate and then fire this sleep dart at you, pitching this endless arrow. So it's coming in for uh, 10. 10. Can I even defend? Which is lethal. Absolutely, yes. I think I just have to try it. I'm going to crack the e pot. He's going for it. Absorb an aether. 
Absorbing Aether. <laughs> what on earth are these cards? Absorbing Aether. I'm going to go ahead and pitch an Epot. Spin Kano. Oh, yeah. Uh, and, uh, yeah. Aether Dart for five. Five. Okay, I will pit, I'll pitch a yellow. So I will A, okay. B, two of it and take three. All right. Sounds good. I will take five. Okay, and then your Kano is turned off until the end of your next turn. That's fine. Doesn't really matter, I guess. And then I get a Ponder, which will just go into my Arsenal. And then it's your go. Yep. My turn is Arsenal Pass. You didn't take any damage from that at all, no? From that attack? I did. I took five. Uh, you said 11? 10. Oh, yeah, I took four. Okay, so you're on four then. Yep. Holy hell. Right. Tunic to two. Cross wrap. Flip up this codex. Look at the top card. Okay. Uh, yeah, okay. Uh, yeah. Deck has worked against me. Ravenous Rabble for four go again. Really, Deck? Really, Deck? Really. Okay. Uh, we're going to pitch a tome. Uh, absorb an Aether. Block four. Nice. Next uh, arcane source I did does uh, two more. Cool. One floating. Activate Azalea. Put this Lace of Blood Rot into my arsenal. Okay. Activate Death Dealer. Pitching a Spire Sniping. So there's two floating. Okay. Actually, no. I'll play the play the Blood Rot first, then use a Death Dealer um, to put this Bolt and Shot in and draw a card. And then shoot this Bolt and Shot for five. Go again. If it hits, reload. I'll block for five. Uh, Paying the last one for that Absorbent Aether. Block for five. Any cards in hand? No. Okay. And then I'll play Codex. Sounds good. So I get back a... Get back a Remorseless. Yep. Uh, discard the card in my hand. And then fire this for five. You got me. Oh, that was a race. I, it's Kano. I I don't I didn't build I don't play standard Kano, man. I I'm not going for combo lines. I'm going for pure numbers. But I, if you understood how many yellows and reds I saw, it was nearly always like almost three to one yellows yellows reds and blues. It was bad. Yeah, that's interesting but though. It happens. I what, what am I gonna do? Get mad about it? <laughs> Absolutely I, not. Oh well. Yeah, we'll go again. See what happens. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Guess they're getting a two for today. Oh yeah, definitely. Pure speed. But yeah, but absorbing Aether is a really, really interesting, interesting card. The fact it it blocks. You have to. Yeah, it costs to pay for it, though, doesn't it? It costs one, doesn't it? One to activate. Um, yeah. It blocks for a certain amount. It blocks for like two, three, and four. But the bigger thing is that it buffs. So it's like crucible, but better. Yeah, it's an interesting card. Cause obviously, it defends, but then it also buffs at the same time. So it's just. But then when it comes back round to your turn, you don't have anything to do if you then use it on all on your opponent's turn. It's a tough one. Yeah. 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 I mean, you're not wrong. I'm thinking about adding. I'm thinking about, I don't know, maybe cutting the yellow, the yellow, but I like the yellow. Yeah. Um. Well, luckily we've got lots of time, so uh, we'll go again. Oh yeah, we'll, we'll I got again. I got nothing going on all night, so this is a great use of my time. Let's go again. I then. prefer. Oh yeah, absolutely. Friggin' lootly. You can go first this time. Okay, cool. Let's go for it. Alright, let's go back up to 30. Yeah, 
Sometimes your boy has it, sometimes he don't. It's okay, no way. Oh, well. Yeah. What are you gonna do? It's nice to see a it's nice to see a different version of Kano though, because a lot of the Kanos that you see out there don't use things like absorbing aether, so it's nice to see it being used. I, I saw it used during the battle hardened and I always just ran the red and the blue, but he made a case, he's like, Why don't you put the yellow in? I'm like I should probably put the yellow in. Uh let me see here. Alright. Tunic up to one. It. I knew it wouldn't matter about Tunic. Tunic wouldn't have saved me at uh, all. That was a very quick game, to be fair. Yeah, I kind of had a feeling it wouldn't. Um, activate uh, Crucible for two for one. Uh, throw Swell Tidings for six. That is six coming at you. Give me one minute. Alright, I'm back. Cool. And that if that deals uh if that deals how much damage you get a ponder? Oh it doesn't really matter, I uh, guess. Uh if it deals more than five, I get a ponder. Alright. Uh I'll pitch a yellow then to A B two, so I take four. Okay. Um I'm gonna go ahead and activate Kano. It's gonna burn me on the first turn. Well, I mean, if it lines up, uh, lesson in lava. Okay, and again, I'll pitch a yellow uh, to prevent two. So I take one, and you go get two. Yep, me. and I'm gonna go search for something one or less. That's right. Two, I have two floating. Yeah, for a wizard card. I mean. I'm quite happy I'm gonna to go for a red absorbent aether. Interesting. Does, doesn't have to be a doesn't have to be an action card, just any nope. wizard card. May search your deck for a wizard card with resource cost less than or equal to the damage dealt by Lesson and Lava. Interesting. Yep. That's why I love it. Actually, I think Absorbent Aether wouldn't be the best choice. Now that I think about it, uh, oh, it's interesting that you can you can go and get that though. Huh? It's interesting that you can go and get that though, because then it means that I have to try and get through another four block that I know you have. So it's interesting that you yeah, can. Um, I switched it up and went for a blue prognosticate. Cool. Um, in this case, I think guaranteeing a blue is probably the better choice. Yeah. In case I need to get a little reactive. Yeah. Because, you know. Makes what sense. was it? Eat. Offense is the best defense. Attack is the best form of defense. Absolutely. Hey, if you never let, if you never let, give them a chance to swing at you, you've done your job. Then you don't have to defend anything. Very true. That's what All I do. All right. Uh, that's my turn. All right. So I will draw two and tune it goes to one. Okay. Oh, wow, this is not good. Interesting. Well, uh, pitch a deaf dealer. Okay. Put in this spire sniping, draw a card, then look at the top two. It's blue spire sniping, isn't it? It is, yeah. Okay. Not the best, unfortunately. But we can still do something. Uh, lace with inertia, then lace with blood rot, and then fire this at you for nine. For nine. Yeah. Now, first things first. Go ahead and activate Kano. Yes. I've got no Ooh. cards in hand, so you can burn the hell out of me if you want. Potion of Deja Vu. Cool. Then I'm just going to go ahead and block eight. So you will take one. Yep. I will take one. Cool. And then you get a Blood Rot and an Inertia. 
Yep. Oh, I'm going to take that, too. I don't... Fantastic. Ain't no shame in my game. Ain't no shame in my game. Nope. Cool. You'll go, then. I'm ending. I'm just drawing. Oh, okay. And two more. Yep. So did tunic you up to two, of course. I'm not going to say no to a tunic. So did you lose the life and then just put your hand away because of the tokens, yeah? I drew back. I just drew the four because I have nothing. And then... I have no arsenal or anything. Cool. And then you took two because of blood rot, yeah? Yep. I'm at 27. Fantastic. Yeah, cool. I, I may have sh I may have shortcutted because you don't draw, then put it down, then draw again. No, that's fine. I mean, if if I did this this hand, this would be nuts. <laughs> I would just make that would make that would mean like I want all the inertia tokens. Yes, please. Yes. And I was like, oh, I draw back, then do it all. Like, okay, pitch, pitch, second inertia token response. And do it all over again. Actually, two inertia tokens with him. With a full grip, might actually be funny. <laughs> right. Uh, it's like, pitch. ah, disappointment. Pitch to FDA, load remorseless, draw card. Uh, Alright, I'm gonna... Dang, eh, whatever. No matter. No responses? Um, I might have had one to the Death Dealer activation, but I don't really think responding to that is the best way to do it so yeah you're good okay then we'll play a ravenous rabble revealing right. a blue sparse typing so only coming in for two we'll go again uh activate kano oh here we go almost against it uh aether flare we're gonna go and pitch for kano again Really, deck? Really? <laughs> I'm going to go ahead and maybe do I just... Uh, we're going to leave that there. Um, we're going to activate Kano. That on the stack. Pop the potion. And it lets me put my all cards from a pitch zone on top of my deck in any order. Reveal an E-Pot, put an E-Pot in play. Okay. Cards in hand? Two. That has go again. Yeah. I'll take the two. Cool. 25. Alrighty then. Uh, and then we will... Uh, Premeditate. That sounds good. Uh, Lace with Frailty. And sounds then, good. And then Remorseless for 11 on Hit Ponder, and then Frailty, which doesn't really matter. I'll block, um, yeah, I'll block for three. Cool. Take eight. 17. Uh, this Spy Sniping I draw from the Ponder goes into my Arsenal, and then it's your go. And this did not get played, so it'll get banished. I'm just drawing my hand at Basson. Turn it to three. <laughs> Cross wrap, flip up this spire sniping. Look at the top two. Yep. Uh... <laughs> Leave them like that, and then cross wrap resolves. That's. That one, yeah. Um, activate Azalea. Put this. Seek uh, okay. What'd you put in there? Seek and destroy. That's a good one. It is a good one. More Arsenal hate. Uh, okay. I think that's a problem. Then we'll play that. All right, plus three on the arrow. Yeah. Use a tunic to fuel Death Dealer. Okay. Uh, load in this Red and the Ledger. Draw this card. Sounds good. Then we will fire this Red and the Ledger for eight 
pitching this uh, other red in the ledger. All right. I'm going to go ahead and activate my boy. Yep. Activate your boy. We'll go ahead and leave that there. You said eight. Uh, and you already activated Death Dealer. Yep. I'll block for nine. Cool. I'll give it go go again with this. Okay. Uh, and also uh, play a Rain Razors. So you will take one on that. All right. Sounds good. Uh, so seeking destroy effect and one action next turn. Uh, All right. Um, and then we will bullseye braces. Okay. Load in this bolt and shot, and then fire this bolt and shot. So it's coming in for five go again. If it hits reload, can't stop it. Going to eleven. Okay. Uh, I said I was a cannon good. player, not a good one. <laughs> reload this into my arsenal, and then I'll fire this as well. So it's a drill shot for six. Go to five. I'll put a minus one counter on the tunic. Uh, that's it. Holy hell. That's a turn. Alright. Go ahead and go to clean up. I ain't got nothing to discard. And was there any blood rot on that? Uh there was nothing on that though. Seeking destroy, that was it. Okay. Yeah, I'm fine then. Cool. Tune it to one. Okay. Uh pitch to death dealer, load bolt and shot, draw. Okay. Uh, release the tension and then bolt and shot for seven. Mm -hmm. Well, hold on. Let's do this right. What am I at? Six? Yeah, I think this is choice. All right. No blocks. I'm going to absorb an aether, blocking four of it. Cool, so three is still going I'm going to spin Kano. Yep. Blocking four, taking three. Okay. Uh, so reload on that, so I'll reload this. And then I'll fire this Remorseless at you. Five. Wait till you find out what was on top of the deck. <laughs> it was absorbed in Ah, oh, sadness. Yeah. What do you do? 